Welcome my friends, my name is Irvin, also known as Kobuman. We have another video on a help desk example phone call in which we fix a WebEx sound issue. It's going to be an exciting one, it's going to be very educational and it's a real world example of something you would get as a phone call when you do help desk tier one. All right, guys, let's get into it. But first, real quick, please take one second to click that like button. This way, I'm not going to play any ads at this point. This makes a huge difference for me. I really appreciate your help on this. Thank you so much. And now let's listen to the call. And then after that, during the call, we're going to pause in the middle of it and I'll show you how to fix this WebEx issue. Thank you for calling Tech Support. My name is Irvin. How can I help you today? Hey, this is Bob. I, uh, I have, I'm having trouble with my um, uh, WebEx meeting. The audio doesn't work. I'm trying to use my headset, but I, I don't know what's going on. It's just that I've been told that uh, they can hear me, but I can't hear them. Or something's going on with, with my headset. I'm, I'm trying to use it for this WebEx. Either like It doesn't matter if I create a meeting or join a meeting. There's always the same issue with the headset. I can't. And it's a new headset I just got from my boss trying to use it here and uh, it's just it's just giving me trouble is this something you can help me out with i sure can uh let me uh let me uh get your uh, pc name real quick there should be a, a pc information uh on your computer for that it's it's okay it could be a computer name or a workstation name there might be even a sticker on your computer can you please give me that sure uh, here it is it's a uh, 35c3to578 thank you very much for that do you mind if I take control of your computer just for a moment? I want to have a look and see what's going on. Sure thing, go ahead, no problem. Now, just real quick, I want to make sure the type of headset that you have, is it a USB one or is it the one that has two prongs or uh, two connectors, if you will? So it's usually, it's uh, um, if it's just a standard one, it's going to have one that's red and the other one is black and you plug it in usually in the front of the PC or is just a USB one? I have one of those that's just a USB one. All right, no problem. I'm, I'm taking a look right now. All right, let's pause the phone call here for a moment so we can troubleshoot, so I can show you how I would troubleshoot this. He mentions uh, audio issues. So every time somebody mentions audio issues, I would definitely look at the audio settings inside the computer. And noticed I specifically asked him if he has a USB, type of uh, headset or if it's just one of those standard ones with two plugs and uh, he said he has a USB one so we're just going to use that knowledge as our starting point all right let's look at the system settings we're going to right click on our speaker icon here I'm going to select open sound settings these are Windows 10 sound settings I'm not a big fan of this it is pretty simple and yes you can do several troubleshooting in here but I prefer to click on the sound control panel here which is the old school way of pulling up and troubleshooting system sound settings for Windows operating systems. So I'm going to minimize this WebEx here just so I can get that out of the way and not distract you with it. So as in uh, the first thing we see here is that we have Realtek high definition audio. This is one of those audio systems that will be on pretty much every computer that has Windows operating system. I guarantee you that if you open up sound settings on your computer right now, you will have a Realtek high definition audio. And we know that this is default sound for that PC, meaning that everything that's built into the computer is going to use this and everything that is plugged into it as in specifically microphone or a headset through the regular 3.5 millimeter connector it's going to use Realtek so we can ignore that part of it right now because we're not going to use it we have to concentrate on a USB headset and he specifically you said the USB the only other thing that shows up here is this Plantronics C610 which is a USB headset and you can see there's a little you know there's a green check mark here that means that right now that Realtek is set as default I'm going to go ahead and change this Plantronics to default I'm going to select it I'm going to click set as default now I know for sure that everything on the system is going to use this playback audio as in speaker as default. So we changed our speakers to Plantronics C610, which is the headset itself. There is nothing else there. So we know for sure that that is the headset that he is using. Now let's go ahead and click on recording here. This is going to be set up for our microphone. 
and here we go again we can see that he has a microphone either built in or plugged in somehow but you know if it's a laptop chances are that it's just a built-in microphone and it's again set to Realtek we don't want that we want to set it to our Plantronics and we're going to set it as default now you don't necessarily want to do this as set it, set things up as a default depending on preference of the customer but a lot of times to make sure that the issue doesn't uh, repeat itself this is what I like to do is set their main audio to default whatever that might be and I will of course double check that with the customer as well so now I know that my microphone is set to the Plantronics which is the headset and also our speaker is set to Plantronics which is the headset I'm going to click OK so now everything else that comes up should be using that as default now let's look at the Webex now keep in mind Webex is kind of tricky when it comes to setting up audio if I click on the little cog here and I click you know just to click on it to see what are the settings where are the settings here for the Webex and of course you can see this that there is a preference and once you open it up you assume that the audio settings would be here but they're not unfortunately you can see that there is account my personal room meeting join phone numbers calendars notifications video system but nothing talks about the audio the audio is actually um, set up when you start a meeting or join a meeting so let's go ahead and click start a meeting and this is going to launch our little start a meeting pop-up so with the start meeting enabled here I know our pop-up comes up we can see there are some things here that are flipping through and we can see that the, this is the audio setting right here we're gonna look at that here in a moment but let's look at this real quick you see how it says here use computer for audio a lot of times if you have a desk phone like one of those physical desk phones that are just sitting on your desk there chances are there might be some kind of integration there and that uh, you want to make sure that it's not detected because you can use a desk phone for uh, Webex meetings and and whatnot especially if it's a Cisco phone uh, usually I uh, over IP phone which all the new phones are but in our case we want to make sure that use computer for audio is selected and uh, let's go ahead and select on our settings here that are kind of flipping through we're going to click on that and see what we have and here we have to make a minor change and change the uh, microphone here to make sure that it reflects our Plantronics headset so we're going to select Plantronics headset or you can click use system settings I prefer just to click it uh, microphone uh, Plantronics so if you're going to set up Webex only and only Webex to use this headset you would make sure that it's selected to the microphone and not use system settings so in case you want to use system settings defaults for something else um, basically what I'm saying is you can configure Webex only to use the headset as well again I'm going to double check this with the customer to see what his preferences are all right let's get back to the phone call all right sir so it, it looks like there's uh, just a configuration issue with the audio the headset is probably working just fine I went ahead and made the changes in the system and the Webex make sure that this is all set to use the headset most of the time now just keep in mind if you're going to use your PC speakers or if you have speakers connected to it these, these settings may have to be changed back but right now I set your headset to default so that way it's always going to use that for the time being um, if you'd like I can change it I can only change I can just change Webex to use it and nothing else no no that's fine I don't use the speakers at all I headset is fine I don't want people to hear me talking anyways or hear hear what other people are saying on the meeting anyways all right no problem I'll go ahead and leave it like that so it's all set to default now and it should work do you want to give it a shot and test it out sure let me uh, let me get my co-worker over here I'm gonna start a meeting real quick and test it uh, with her hey Susan you mind testing this with me all right thank you go ahead and join can you hear me yes yeah I, I can hear you fine too awesome all right cool thank you thank you for testing this with me hello yeah um, it's working it's working fine now so uh, th thanks for fixing that for me it was it was so annoying every time I joined the meeting it just didn't work no problem I'm glad to help um, is there anything else I can assist you with today no that's it uh, you've been great help thank you so much you bet you have a good day thank you you too bye 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 
And there you have it guys, another successful help desk tier 1 phone call handled like an IT professional. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments below. Check out my channel, I have a lot more of this type of stuff. I have already made a few of videos that are in this format, so if you, if you want to check them out, I, I forget exactly what they were, I think one of them was on resetting passwords, the other one was on some other stuff. Anyways, I have so much I can't remember. But anyways, I try to make these videos at least once a week. Typically, they come out on Saturdays or Sundays when I have free time, uh, you know, from my job and whatnot. But uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy it. Please share it with friends. Let me know what you think. If you just want to say hi, I, you know, I'd like, I like those comments as well. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. You have a wonderful day. Bye-bye. <clears throat>